<coughs> Hello everybody, my name is Bra Brandon and today I'm going to do a different video. So this is so So if you watch my channel lately you would notice that I'm I've been making YouTube videos of this game called Survive and Kill the Killers in Area 51. So I'm going to do a tier list about my opinions about these killers and to see if they're good, bad, or you know. So let's get started. Jane is terrible because all because all she does is attack Jeff only. Like in killer mode, her is boring, but she can be good in classic mode to take out Jeff. Jeff is the worst killer in the game. And the reason why is because he has no special powers and, and another killer, Jane, will attack him. So he sucks. So if you play killer mode, I do not, I do not recommend playing as him. Because, because first of all, you have no special abilities. Yeah, yeah, all you can do is melee attack with your, your stupid knife. And, and plus, while you're trying to hunt the survivors with no special powers, uh, Jane will try. Uh, uh, Jane will attack you as well. Uh, so Jeff sucks. He's terrible. Killer can be a uh, robot. Can be an awesome robot because. He, he can shoot because of, from, from my experience in the game, I, I noticed he can shoot from long dis distance, which is good. So we also got but Jack. He is also a, a, a good killer, maybe. He's like Alien, except he shoots a black stuff, so he might be better than Alien. Pennywise can be good. Because he has melee attack and can throw his knife. He has razor range attack, which is good for killer mode. Tails doll can be good because he, uh, he cannot be damaged from the bomb because he floats. Plus, he has the whole. He appears on your screen. The closer he gets to you, make it hard to see him. Uh, Michael sucks because he has, he literally, he's trash, he has no special powers. This Pyramid Head can be a bit better since he has his explosive attack. And there's Ghost Face, he may, he may not be good as he seems. Because all he does is takes away his weapons from the player, but he, he never used them, plus he can only do it once in the game. Uh, his zombie's garbage because he's because he's literally just he has no special powers. Freddy Krueger is is okay because of his long range. So is Jason, the same reason. Leatherface too. Sonic, uh, yeah, Alien. I'm not trying to. Alien, it, it's like J, J, it's like Jack, but worse. Uh, Granny can be good. Captain Zombie is good too because of something zombie. There's Ray, who's awesome because he's lunges attack. There's Chucky, he's also awesome because he, why I play as him, I notice he can instant kill player. And we got Slenderman. So I think Slenderman is the best killer and the, and the most dangerous one in the game. And the reason why is because he has multiple abilities. Usually killers have one uh, ability uh, and Tails has two abilities, but Slenderman has, he literally has Four abilities: his teleportation, his uh, camouflage ability, his jump scare, and hmm. 
Well, actually, uh, guys, they got it wrong. Yeah, he has three abilities. He has his camouflage, his teleportation. Oh yeah, he has four abilities. He has his teleportation, his his camouflage ability, his jump scare, and his instant kill ability. His teleportation ability is very useful. It's like the rake, but better because he's sneakier. Unlike the rake, where it's where you would know he's coming at you when he lunges, because you hear a roaring sound and he flies towards you. Slenderman is another good ability. Is his instant kill. He can instant kill players that when he hits them. And he can also camouflage himself. After he spawned in, after a certain amount of time, he will become harder to see, which can be helpful when the, the players are looking for Slenderman. And the fourth one is the jump scare. Even though it doesn't really benefit Slenderman, it just makes him creepier and more different than the other killers who don't really have jump scares. And I think that's the reason why Slenderman uh, is one of the few uh, killers who was locked up, the other one being Alien, due to his acid spit being very powerful. Slenderman is being locked up in a cage because of how dangerous he is, because he has m more powers than the other killers. And plus, yeah, the, 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 it would make sense for him to be locked up uh, in the cage, unlike the other killers who are just roaming around uh, because of because of how dangerous of he is. So guys, so so that is my ranking for the killers in this game. I hope you like this video. Hit the subscribe and type the notification. I'll see you in the next video. Bye. Have a uh, good night.